Hello guys, welcome back and in this episode we are going to talk about list. So what is list? Just like in array in other languages we have list in python. But there are a few differences, let's see. Now to define a list we enclose a few values in square brackets. And let's say my list is equals to 1, 2, 3 and 4 and I print my list which is 1, 2, 3 and 4. In list you have the privilege to add other data types also like this let's say I add 5 and then print and so we have 1 2 3 4 and a string 5. Now if I want to check the data type of this third index 0 1 2 3 which is an end and now if I check the index of fourth element it is a string so that means a string is a python equivalent of array but can contain elements of different data types and it is resizable also now if you want to access the list you can print any element with its index like this we have printed index at 2 and as list starts with index 0 we have printed 3 now if i say if you want to print the last element if you do minus 1 in the index it takes the last index just like my list and minus 1 as index gives you 5. Similarly, if you do minus 2, it, it will give you second last element. Now, if I want to assign some different value to an index, I assign at index third value foo. I run this cell and see 4 has been replaced with foo. Now, if I want to append some value, append means at the end of the list, like we have these three elements, you can add one more element that says bar. Let's see, I run this cell and 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and bar. So just like append, we have several more inbuilt functions in list that we can use. Just like we have a pop element which pops the last element like bar has been popped. And if you want to save the popped element, you can do it like this also. Now if I pop again, my 5 is popped and it has been saved in this variable. If I print it here, 5. So there are some other inbuilt functions also in the list. Let's see. Now we have insert and my list dot insert. We can insert an element. Let's say I want to insert an element in the index 0th and I want to say first. Now let's see. See this first has been inserted in the first element or the 0th index element. Now if I want to remove an element my list dot remove you have to give the element that you want to remove and if I want to remove foo just like that you can remove this and if I print my list you can see that foo has been removed. Now if I want to add multiple elements in the list, just like we have append the list with one element, we can extend the list with several more elements. Let's see. My list dot extend and if I give another list here, 4, 5, 6, let's see. See, 4, 5, 6 has been appended. So basically what, what we have done, we have passed this list and we want to extend it in the, in the list, my list and it has been done here. So these are a few things that are pre inbuilt functions of list that we can use. Now let's see how can we do slicing in the list. Just like we have seen in strings, we can perform in list also. If I want from second index all the elements to get print 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6 has been printed because that means if my value after colon is empty that means you have to go to the last element just like this if you want to start from beginning and want to go to the last element you can do it like this and it will print the complete list because you have not mentioned the starting index as well as the ending index. 
these things can be performed in many such ways. I will show you one more. If you want to go from second index to sixth index, let's see. From second index, that means it will start from two and it will go to the sixth index. Third, fourth, fifth, and sixth has not been. See, one thing here sixth index has not been printed because it will just stop before sixth index. That is what this last index means in list. So, in list, what we have saw, we have discussed about these inbuilt functions append, pop, insert, remove, extend right and we have saw how slicing is done and we have also discussed that we can incorporate any data type in the list thanks for listening and see you in the next video